against a Houston woman accused of mailing explosive devices to Governor Greg Abbott and former President Barack Obama. And we're learning tonight the governor had a very close call. Brett Buffington is live at the federal courthouse tonight with more on the story. Brett? Well, and according to the indictments that have Julia Poff in jail tonight, we are learning that the box mailed to the governor's mansion was in fact opened by the governor himself and court documents say the only reason that that explosive device didn't go off is because the governor opened the box wrong. Experts testified the explosive materials inside the box would have caused severe burns and likely death had they gone off. The indictment says Poff mailed the packages because she was upset with her ex-husband for failing to pay support. A third box was also mailed to the former Social Security Commissioner. Now, this was all back in 2016, but it wasn't until just earlier this month that Poff was charged. Federal investigators were able to connect Julia Poff to the packages using pieces of the shipping labels and matched cat hair found in the box mailed to President Obama with Poff's cat. Now, this evening, we went to several neighborhoods where Poff apparently used to live, but no one in those neighborhoods remembers living next to this woman. I can also tell you Poff is being charged with apparently attempting to scam the federal food stamp program as well as filing a fake bankruptcy. We're live tonight at the federal courthouse. Fred Buffington, KHOU 11 News.